everybody, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrance. I uh, thank you for staying tuned for another video, and I'm happy to have Liz back on the channel again. So, it's the third video in a row, so this is what you guys get. So, you guys wanted it, so you get it. So, if I bring it back again, I'm gonna try to, but be thankful for this three videos made with Liz. So, I'm happy to have her on the channel again. I know you guys like to have more females to see on my channel, so here we go. These are top six like or dislike fragrances. So, she's gonna smell these fragrances from the opening. To the dry down and then she's gonna go back and see which one she prefers she like to smell on a guy it's pretty simple i don't want to go over notes too much because most of these fragrances i have full reviews you can check out my channel down below i have over 485 videos so it's a lot of videos so here we go the first one is a new one from 2019 it's no other than dolce gabbana k for king How you feel this, about it? This one's a... Is it nice, simple, not really that good? How do you feel about it? Yeah, it's it's uh, it's simple. Okay. Um, I don't feel strongly, yeah. positively about it. Nothing so. special? Okay, no, no problem. Exactly. All right, put this to the side, see if she likes to dry down later, so. It, it smells like a lot of the other ones I've smelled. Oh, no problem. That's in, in previous videos. <laughs> no problem. So the next one here is a fragrance I recently got from a sponsored video I did. So the company is made in 1821. This is a fragrance. See how she feels about this one? Mm. I like this one. Oh, she likes it? Okay. 1821. She likes it? Okay. What's in this one? This one has this very heavy tobacco fragrance. Really? Mm-hmm. Huh. Yeah, there's, I, I I didn't recognize the scent. Yeah, a little, it's like a little whiskey, a little boozy-like. So, mm -hmm. so I know this is like people say it's a perfect fall and winter fragrance. So yeah. you, you like this one? Or yes, okay. I do. All right, so this would be, so far this is our favorite so far. Put that right. Yeah. This is a new flanker to it. This is Dolce Gabbana. Again, this is called Light Blue Sun Pour Em. It's okay. It's, it's light. Yeah. Um, very. I know it's, people do say it's very salty. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Mind you, like the summertime. Oh, yeah, I like so. this one for the summertime. Okay, cool. So she does like this a little bit. Okay. All right. Now we're gonna jump into another Gucci fragrance. I know she did Gucci fragrance in the last video. See if she like this Gucci. Gucci doesn't hit many wonders for females in my channel. You can ask my girlfriend Kelly. <laughs> so this is Gucci. This is called Amar du Nodur, and this is supposed to be a memory. Translates to memory. This is a unisex fragrance too, or gender gender free. Yeah, I don't really like this one. Okay, no problem, no problem. It's reminding me of something and I can't quite place it. Okay. Um, At least, so she's not a big fan of it, so no problem. No, no problem, all right. We'll go it back to the dry down and see. It doesn't have much of a scent anyway. No problem. We'll go back to the dry down and see if she feels differently. And she hasn't really tried a lot as well as fragrances, so I'm very excited for her to try this one out. This is a 2019 release. This is from the House of Zoologists and it's Squid. See how she feels about this. I don't really like this. One. Okay, she don't like squid. Okay, squid. Is no it fun. supposed to smell like squid? Um, it has a like a black inky note. It's supposed to have in there, and it's supposed to have <laughs> some amber, and it's supposed to have a lot of very sea, sea salty kind of vibe, like the Dolce Gabbana, was like kind of like the sea and the ocean. So it may not be everybody's taste, but this is the most safest from your line. Okay. So, but it's not like, yeah. I mean, everybody may not be wowed by it, but I know you said it's not the, your, you know. Yeah. So. Smell like a pirate. Yeah. <laughs> no worries. Who hasn't, it's hard who hasn't shaved <laughs> showered. Yeah, don't no worry. It's fine. Now we have one fragrance left, ladies and gentlemen. This one is a real good fragrance. Um, It got a lot of hype in the community. It still gets a little bit of hype here and there. It is kind of expensive fragrance, and I'm going to see if she likes it. It's new to my collection, which I have a full review Coming soon, let's see if she likes this one. From the house of Matt Sarah. And this fragrance is no other than Instant Crush. There you go. See how she feels about Instant Crush. Um, this one's okay. It's okay? Alright. Yeah, I'm not crazy about it no like problem. I was with the, the tobacco <laughs> one, but. Yeah, it's, it's right. So now we're gonna go back to the beginning and uh, try them out again, and she'll pick the three that her favorite one, and she'll pick two other ones that she suggests you should try out. We're gonna start back off with Dolce Gabbana. Okay. See how she feels about this though. Maybe she changed her mind. Maybe she feels the same. Yeah, this one's okay, but not, mm -hmm. not super impressive. No problem. Okay. Put that in the no pile, so that one will not be in the top three. And we're going back to one that she really likes a lot. This is. 18, mid 1821. Mm, yeah. Still up there? Yeah. <laughs> okay, all right, so this is okay. So I'm gonna make this number one so far. Like, 
<laughs> this one makes me think of the commercial of the most interesting man in the world. Okay. <laughs> just like, I just want to know more about. Okay. That's that awesome. <laughs> and that's a great picture for that. Great picture to, now for that fragrance. Great picture overall. The picture conversation that. started. Yes, it is. To the Gucci again, see if she changed her mind or not. Because I wanted to open and dry down because when you get a fragrance, the person may not smell the open, they might smell the dry down because after an hour or so, it participates to the mid and the dry down. So here we go. This is the Gucci again. See what her opinion is after a little bit of time. Yeah, no. No? All right. <laughs> so we got... I don't know. It almost smells like... Um... Like silly putty. I know my I know my girlfriend Kelly says smell like kind of like an old lady kind of like vibe. This shit on her skin, she smells no it's problem. It's like a plasticky. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nothing you would like to smell on a guy. No problem. Yeah. yeah. Cool. This is Dolce Gabbana, light blue sun poro. See how she feels about the dry down. If it oh, got yeah. better or worse. I still like it. Like this one. Okay. Cool. I will put this in the pile. Yeah. Put this there, and she'll pick out of this one and another. Right one. again. This is a wild squid. See if she likes to dry down a little bit better than opening. I just don't really prefer no problem. Yeah. She'll prefer no problem. Hey, all right. So we have three down that she's not gonna that she's not a fan of. Matt Sarah, instant crush. Um, I like it okay. It's okay. All right. So now we're gonna have her pick the three that she likes. So she's gonna pick one at a time. So we're gonna start with the number third. Okay. Your least favorite. Out of, out of, I know we, we already know okay. number one so, is number three. So this one would be number number three. Okay. This is Matt Sarah Instant Crush is her number three. Number two. Okay. Dolce Gabbana Light Blue Sun. And her favorite number one right here is yeah. Made in 1821. And it's, it's, and it's sweet tobacco. Yep. Yeah. So it, and it's, it's one of those fragrances where it's like it's great for the fall and winter and it does project very nicely. You know, and it's a fragrance that I get well over at least eight hours on my skin. So I can spray two or three sprays, go out for a day, go to work, mm -hmm. and I don't have to worry about not smelling it throughout the eight hours. So people will still smell it often. And this fragrance is about, I think it's about $40, $50 online. So mm -hmm. this is a, this is pretty cheap, and it's a 100, 100 ml bottle, so does, you're not going to go through it fast. Does, uh, does Kelly like that one? Um, I'm not sure if Kelly likes this one or not. I, I, um, I don't know if I did a video with Kelly, but I think i got to make a video, yeah. a full review on this one with Kelly and see I'm if curious. she likes it. <laughs> So I'd like to cool. thank ladies and gentlemen for watching another video. I thank Liz for being back sure. in the video. If you like videos like this and more, please start clicking that red subscribe button, hitting that like button, leave a comment down below. Until next time, bye. Bye.